The world today is suffocated with words, but starved of love. I read those words by David Watson in a book published in 1978. Over 40 years ago, Watson revealed one of the greatest ills in our world. How did we get to this place that we're in? This de-evolution of love for our fellow person, this devaluing and demeaning of the image of God in each other, creating ideological enemies and combatants instead of brothers and sisters. In a world filled with strife and animosity of pain, turmoil, contempt for our fellow brothers and sisters, in a world starved of love, what would it look like to create a community of people who were committed? No, 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 who were devoted to infusing the world around them with love? What would it look like to build a church upon an ethic of love? What would it look like to catalyze a people into the neighborhood around them and love deeply, faithfully, without end? You see, this is what we have been building towards. This is what we have been devoting ourselves to creating. We are working towards not only a greater understanding, but a deeper way of living out Jesus' radical love in our midst and in our neighborhood these past two years as a church. And we're only just beginning. And you too can be a part of this movement of people committed to a radical ethic of love in our neighborhood in the name of Jesus. And know that in this endeavor, you'll never walk alone.